Hello Taurus, this is Sagey Intuitive. Welcome to my channel. We are here to do a rating for our singles. So those who are single, looking for love, or just trying to figure out what's going on in their love life. Um, we're going to start with our overall energy. We're going to jump right in. Any information about me or about the channel can be found in the description box. Let's get started. So overall energy with the Taurus is how they're feeling about singlehood right now single dumb i don't know what term we want to use here but let's see let's see how we're feeling with tara singles oh you guys have a particular card that really wants to come out there we go Let's see what this looks like. Wow. So if you have Aries in your chart, um, check that out. Um, but we have the knowledge card. So wanting to maybe you're spending a lot of time trying to learn something new, working on a business, working on um, something particular, uh, maybe not focusing on love so much, but really trying to figure out hey well let's let's build some foundations in other areas of my life you're trying to build up your knowledge on something something special to you something particular to you um something maybe other than love maybe you're learning yourself a little bit more but if you have aries in your chart you might want to look at the aries singles reading because this is a card that came out for aries as well all right and you guys saw me shuffling and you saw me i'm um, doing that so no coincidences there so let's start right out the gate how do you feel about love how do the Taurus singles feel about love how does Taurus singles feel about love right now Taurus singles how do you feel about love there we go Free spirited, wanting to do your own thing. You're, you know, you're feeling kind of passionate, um, but not putting too much stock into any one thing. You're kind of just out there, um, not not making taking things too serious, right? Because there was there, um, you come to some type of completion when it came to your, to your love life. Um, but it doesn't seem like a bad completion, um, a bad end of a cycle. It's like you ended some type of cycle and you're like happier, you're freer, you're embracing um, this feeling. So what happened in the past? What happened in the past for the Taurus is here? What happened in the past? Feeling left out in a cold, maybe people not um, not really um, giving you what you wanted or needed. Um, and it's funny because it's like you may feel that way, even though you have the key to move forward. You're not seeing it. So in the past, you may have just felt like um, you just weren't getting what you wanted and you you were wanting someone to come in and bring you flowers and candy or whatever it is that make you feel special that's what you were wanting but you didn't get that right um and so now we're in a place where maybe you ended those type of cycles of feeling you know defeated feeling down and out in your love life here what's the best asset you have right now what is the best asset in love that you have what's working for you that you are that you're doing your thing that you're passionate that you can manifest any single thing that you want here that you are transforming because we saw here that you ended some type of cycle this was a death and rebirth this is actually working for you so this time that you are alone is working really in your favor so embrace that and it seems like that's what you're doing twice you have wands here wands here you're embracing this passion maybe this is a new passion for yourself but you're really embracing this um, and how it's working for you so what is it that you think you want right now when it comes to love for Taurus what do you think you want what is it that you think you want
so you, th you think that you you want to be in control with the mental with from a mental perspective controlling your mind you want to be abundant on your own but you also want to you definitely want to keep control of everything you you feel that if you show a person that is in control of their life a person who's independent can do things for themselves who has their own bag right this is this is what's what's gonna um help you elevate this is what you feel that you want you want someone to also come in who has their own you want someone that's going to come in and be clear um with you that's going to tell you the truth no matter what you want a person that's independent because that's what you are at this time you want a person who has their has their own and can match you from where you are what is it that you actually need Taurus in love right now what is it that you need Is it Taurus's need? So many. What is it that Taurus's need right now? All right. Okay, needing to to have a victory in love because you've been waiting so long. For some of you, you are wanting this victory. You're wanting the success. This is what you need. You need a win, right? That is what it says here. You need a win because you've been waiting and you need this win, right? You've been fighting here and it's like, no, I need a win. I have done all of this stuff. I have done this work. Help me win. Taurus wants a win <laughs> right now. What's your challenge in love? What is your challenge? Things that you're passionate about, your mental um, perspective on things, but um, how you're seeing things, um, your challenges that maybe you're not following your intuition, not manifesting enough um, because you want this win, but, um, but maybe you're not breaking that down right to manifest how you want because here we go that success that stability um this fun this life here you may need to think about doing some some things that are increase your intuition taurus uh maybe doing some meditation maybe doing some journaling um connect with a tribe of people who can help you kind of work through that but you definitely need to go within your mental state and use your third eye so that you can follow your intuition and see what is out there for you at this time. So let's see uh, what action do you need to take? Let's see what action do you need to take in love right now? There we go. Intuition following, following uh, what you know is right, going within, doing what feels good to you. Because it feels like you have these options here, but needing to go and see what feels good to you um, here. Like even here, you have your head turned. Um, and I'm interpreting this just this time. <laughs> and then here we go. Headache. That, I don't know why that comes Kate has come to me. Not following your intuition, um, needing to, to follow your um your sacral uh, your sacral chakras um what feels good to you because you feel like you've been it's all been a big headache right so really identifying what it is that you need to do so that's the action you need to take what do i want at the end of the day you're bored but let's see what do you want what what do you actually want figure that out that is what's going to help you so any potential lovers coming in the near future? So let's see. Let's see about any potential lovers coming in the near future here. Yes, potential lovers coming a lot and fast. So we saw over here that, boom, the, all these people come in. Maybe you're still trying to figure out what you want. But who is coming in the near future? You have a lot of options that are coming in. Now, some of them may make you feel a little conflicted. 
and you need to, but this is still telling me you need to get this enlightenment work on your um your third eye or get balance your chakras out because you may need to get this enlightenment going um, but someone is going to come in here or a bunch of people are going to come in. That's why it's important for you to realize and figure out what it is that works for you and that you want. Because there are people coming in. And if you have not identified what works for you, this may bring you more back into this headache here. Back into this board. I'm like, oh gosh, here we go again. You want stability. You want a family. You want long term a long-term relationship so identify what it is that you want in love so what is the advice let's get a final card for advice here <laughs> exactly what we said balance 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 out those chakras get in inside make some decisions get that third eye going balance those that sacral that heart that throat so you can communicate what it is that you want so you know what to send to the side and what to keep balance 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 so that is what i have for you taurus don't forget to like share and subscribe certainly leave me a comment and i will see you all again soon take care